Pastor Marvin here with you from Step of Faith Ministries. You know, just this week, um, I believe it was Monday, you know, I was really excited because I found this new app called Wish. And on this app, I had really found a smoking deal. And I was planning on buying this shirt right here, if you can see. I was going to buy this shirt. So it was like 17 bucks. So I'm like, man, I got to get this shirt. So I ordered the shirt, right? And everything was set. I paid for it, gave them my card. And within 24 hours, I received an email from the company saying that my order wasn't processed in time to get the deal. In other words, what they were telling me was I was a day late and a dollar short. Oh, I can't even believe you let them play you like that. You gave them your card information. They took the money out your account. And then they're going to try to tell you that you didn't make the timeline and get to get the deal. Man, I don't even want my money back. I tell them to come on off that shirt for the price. What you mean how I let them play me? Those are just the terms, rules, and conditions in order for the shoppers to participate on their site. I just found out that I was a day late and a dollar short. Dang! And you know what, though? After going through that experience, it got me to thinking. You know, in the United States, with the climate that we're in, when we're seeing uh, police brutality, when we're seeing social injustices, when we're seeing racism, when we're seeing systematic racism, I'm just wondering, are all of these things that we're witnessing and some of us are experiencing, are they symptoms of the source? Let me give you an example. About two years ago, I had a horrible toothache. And you know what? It was hurting so bad and I waited so long that I was experiencing multiple symptoms. Not only was my mouth hurting, not only did I have a headache, but I had a big old knot on my forehead because I'd allowed the infection to spread. And you know what? Those were all symptoms. But you know what the source was? I had a rotten tooth in my mouth. And so while I was taking uh, aspirin, while I was taking ibuprofen, those were just treating the symptoms. But really what I needed to do was go to the doctor so I could get to the source. Chapter 6 verse 12 states the following. This is not a wrestling match against a human opponent. We are wrestling with rulers, authorities, the powers who govern this world of darkness and spiritual forces that control evil in the heavenly world. What I mean is you got black people fighting white people. You got white people fighting black people. You got Hispanics fighting everybody for their rights to be here. And you got Chinese people that are indifferent to the whole situation. But here, here it is in a nutshell. Why do we keep protesting, fighting against racism, which is a symptom? Why do we protest against inequality, which that is a symptom? Why do we protest against police brutality when that is a symptom? And we don't give any attention to the source. There is a spirit behind all of these symptoms, right? And this spirit behind all of these symptoms have got us bamboozled to where we're fighting one another. We see each other as the enemy. But once we take off our natural eyes and look at things from a spiritual sense, we can start to combat where it's coming from. We can start to attack the source instead of the symptoms. I'm just saying, the time that we invest in treating and fighting the symptoms, maybe that time can be better invested if we would start fighting against the source. Pastor Marvin with Step of Faith, let's make it a great one. God bless you.